Hey guys, yeah, welcome back to another video. I'm just going to do a little intro on this and I'll let you enjoy the rest of the video. But basic, I didn't really want to do start doing videos like this again. I really don't because it's kind of looking bad. It's making the drifting community look bad, basically. But what it is, is um, I was basically drifting online with a few people. Oh, some really good people in the lobby. And um, FC Blake come in i think his name was uh and his mate uh fc bunto whatever you call it i don't know i don't know how you say it properly but um i beat fc blake three of uh, three games in a row i beat him three games in a row um i didn't beat his teammate fc bunter because he is very good i won't deny that his teammate is very good um uh, but i beat fc blake three times in a row and then he got extremely salty and the game after that he basically got his teammate just to ram me um so i dropped i think it was like 60k plus points so his mate could win um it's kind of dirty tactics what people used to do back in like forza 4 and forza 3 i didn't realize people still did that on forza 7 but here we are um and it is kind of embarrassing because it's like the fc clan tag from what i know of the fc they are extremely good and don't get me wrong you see them all out leaderboards but the problem with leaderboards is they hit that same track on the leaderboards for about a week straight to get a good score on there and that's how they get first place because they just sit and do it for basically a week everyone what drifts leaderboards know this um and i refuse to do that so i don't see point and it's i don't know if it's more embarrassing for blake or what because it's like i took a year out of forza you all know this it's like forza 7 come out i played it for about a week or two then I stopped playing it for a year. It was a good year, year plus. Then I come back into the game and I went from drifting all-wheel drive only to only drifting rear-wheel drive. So I took like a year plus out of the game, come back, drifting rear-wheel drive only. And drifting rear-wheel drive without a tuning setup on, which you guys already know, I've already done a video on this. Um, and it's kind of embarrassing where a pure all-wheel drive drifters come back into game after not playing it for a year and a half, uh, a year plus, gone into rear-wheel drive only, not using a drift tune, and a clan like FC, or FC Blake, should I say. Um, I ain't got no beef with the other dude. The other dude's good. FC, whatever you want to call him, other dude, he's actually really good. Uh, but then people like FC Blake, well, play the game non-stop. As soon as they start losing, they get extremely salty and start getting their mates to ram you. Now, I don't know. It just shows what type of people they are, to be honest with you. Um, so I'm going to let the video roll now. And the scoreboard will be at the end of the video of me beating him. I was beat him on best lap and I beat him on overall score. And I'm also going to show the message what he basically sent me saying that I'm no good at drifting, basically call me a nobody and that I'd never beat him. And he's been calling me delusional because I said I beat him. And he's basically he's acting like how people used to act in Forza 3 where they just think they are the best in the world and nobody else can beat them and... Do you, know, you, you know what I mean when you come across people like that. Now, don't get me wrong. I ain't no good drifter. I'll put my hand up to it. I'm an average drifter. I wouldn't even class myself as average. I'd probably class myself below average drifter. But it's kind of funny and it's kind of entertaining. And it's kind of, it's kind of like... They, they think... He thinks he is almighty. Then someone like me, what doesn't barely barely plays the game, 
drifting a drive train he never used to drift without a tuning set up on and I beat him. Um kinda says it all. But hope you enjoyed the rest of the video. The messages will be in end with a screenshot of the scores of what everyone got in that game. So yeah, thank you for watching and enjoy it.